everybody, this is Adventist Key Master, and I want to talk about something today that's really special. So today is Walt Disney's birthday, and it is so cool to, to celebrate the man who started it all and built the best park in the entire world. Disneyland is my favorite park, and I love Disney. So today, Walt Disney was born on this day back in 1901, and he created something that no one else would didn't believe or no one else could see. And that is Disneyland. And it has a lot of history. He has a lot of history. And I want to talk about him. And I want to talk about the man who started it all by a mouse. And I got to say. So Walt Disney is a hero of mine. Because on how many times he failed. He failed so many times. And trying to secure the land for Disneyland was 44 different times. And that was so cool. Because you got to think on how much pain and how much suffering he went through. He even when he came back when he came here to LA in nineteen in the nineteen um twenties, he was broke. He lived on one can one year of canned of canned beans. That is cool. I mean he was literally poor and he created something that no one else ever made. And I gotta say Walt Disney is one of my favorite heroes. He knows everything and I gotta say he's he's been one of my favorite heroes for years and um well let's talk about let's talk about him for a bit so Walt Disney was born on this day in in a small town of Illinois in back in 1901 and Walt Disney had this dream that no one else could ever see 1937 and 1955 well let's talk about him for a bit so Walt Disney did something that no one else could ever make in 1937, he made Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, a full-length animated film that no one has ever done ever because, well, they were cartoons, and no a lot, not a lot of cartoons were put into movies. And you think about Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs as a huge success, which started all. And it was starred by Mickey, 1928. And it was starred by, and then he'd, be, and he'd build Disneyland, and so on. But well, what makes this really special is that Walt Disney had a dream. He's a huge he's a huge hero of mine because I gotta say, um, the reason why he's a huge hero of mine because how many times he failed, how many times he never gave up, and how many times he failed miserable and was on a year of canned beans for one entire year because he was broke. I mean, that is pretty cool to know that this guy that built Disneyland was poor as dirt and still managed to make this beautiful park and that's that's amazing fact number 2 Disney Walt Disney had his fav had a favorite princess yes he had a favorite princess minus Tiana's because I love I love Tiana she's one of my favorite princesses but Walt Disney had his favorite also and that was Cinderella. Cinderella was his first, was his favorite princess. Even though Snow White was his first Disney princess, he, I guess he loved the story. And what I'm hearing is that he used to read the story to his girls. He had two girls. He had, um, he married his, interesting fact, he married Lillian Disney. And he had, he had four, he had four, bro he had um, brothers and sisters. He had siblings, four siblings, and he used to read these stories to his to his little girls when they were very young, and yeah, he he loved he loved his park so much that he literally died in Disneyland, and I think that's awesome because he wanted to stick to his plan and just go die in his favorite place. One thing that one uh, fact number three, um, Walt Disney had had two daughters. Di um, Dana or Diana and Sharon who was adopted back was adopted and that is pretty cool because you know um, you don't see a lot of people with adopted children but Walt Disney actually adopted um, Sharon uh, Sharon Disney back um, in the 30s and and he loved her like she was his own and I think that's pretty cool to see that that this guy really made a family and he enjoyed life he he envisioned something that could never have ever has happened which is awesome fact number four 
So Walt Disney did so Walt Disney did start with Mickey Mouse in 1928, which started a gold mine. And one, one fact I know is that Snow White Seven Dwarfs won Oscar in that 1938. And what's funny is that still this day, Walt Disney has the most Oscars and the most Academy Awards ever, and it's 26, and no one has ever done that. Yeah, so that's pretty cool to see that this guy really had a one hell of a life. He had a great time with life, and he just made something that was never made, that was never possible. No one believed him, and I believe I believe this guy really needs. He's one of my favorite heroes, and he's absolutely an awesome person. So I was gonna. So I'm signing off. So I'll be. So I'll be, I'm out. And I'll be making more videos more. I'll be making a lot more videos between Disney and anime. And what's going on with Kingdom Hearts 3. With Kingdom Hearts 2.8. A Final Fantasy. And yeah. So I'm Vesta Keymaster. Hope everyone enjoys their day. I'm out. Peace. And I hope everyone has a good day.